This morning for breakfast, we are having oatmeal, and I'm putting the cherry berry blend into the oatmeal. And all I'm doing is microwaving my oatmeal in the microwave because I'm super duper lazy. And this is a small bowl. I don't have any really big bowls um, of to use right now. So I'm going to make like two or three of these depending on how hungry I am. So I'll eat till I'm full. So that's breakfast. That's the finished product. I think I might even put some cinnamon on it. But it is delicious. This is the grocery haul today. After going to Price Shopper. Didn't get too much, but enough for a couple of days anyway. I got about two bags of these. Um, I wish they had a little bigger size with the amount of rice that I end up going through in a week, but this is okay. Um, this is the four pound bag of eight pounds total. And these were $2 a piece. So it was really cheap rice. I get rice from also the Thai market that's in town too, and I'll film that a little later. Some snap peas. Price Shoppers also started doing a sushi section, and they had the vegetable, and they're pretty cheap. Uh, they're only like six twenty-five, and that's pretty inexpensive for sushi around here. So I thought I would have that as part of my lunch today. I got bread to go with the smoked um, tofu and the smoked. Um, Jackfruit, the smoked jackfruit I made. So that'll be really good. This is to go in some of the rice. Same thing here. And um, with the other frozen vegetables, I do like a frozen mix. Um, I got some acorn squash, some bananas, a lot of apples. A lot of apples uh, for my daughter's eight apples here. She goes through at least one apple a day. And I, uh, I sometimes will eat one too. I'm not a big apple fan though, honestly. Uh, I wanted some salad, so this isn't a bad mix salad. These I buy every once in a while. I really do like them. They're sun-dried tomatoes, and they are not packed in oil, so there's zero fat in them, and they're really good in pasta. So, like, I will make a big thing of pasta, do, like, frozen vegetables, and throw in those, too, like, in a pot. Um, and stir fry like the vegetables just a little bit to get them nice and and uh, kind of crisp. Um, I like to also put in these. I will sometimes eat these on their own because they're delicious, but then I will sometimes cut them up too for like you know whatever. And these are really convenient because they're so small, so you don't have to use like an entire big bell pepper um, or capsicum depending on where you're from. Um, I also got a sweet potato. I think I will cook that guy up today to go with um, the rolls. And then I'll probably make some extra rice too to go with that as well. So that is a small grocery haul for the beginning of the week. I expect to probably visit the store on Friday or Saturday of this week. Oh, and I also did get some grapes, but I left them in the car, so I have to go get my grapes now. It's a huge, huge bag of grapes, and I'm going to eat that this morning for breakfast. So this is the result of the smoked tofu and the smoked jackfruit. So I have already eaten quite a bit of it, as you can see. Now, you can barely see it, but if you let the tofu go long enough in a smoker, you will get a smoke ring. Um, I only cooked these in the smoker for two and a half hours, I want to say, which is great for the jackfruit because you don't want it to get like super dry or anything sitting in the smoker. So this is really juicy jackfruit. And I'm going to put this 
Kansas City LC famous barbecue sauce on there. It's sweet and a little vinegary. It's one of my favorites. And I just put it on um, a French bread from our local price chopper. I will also make probably a sandwich out of the tofu as well. And it's really good. So if you let the tofu go for maybe four hours, you'll actually get a smoke ring that, that's a bit more visible. So, <coughs> excuse me. So that is dinner. Okay, and that was what I ate today. Um, we are going to be decorating for Halloween, so I will probably put that up as soon as we get done with it. Um, I don't really have much else to say, necessarily. I watched Game Changers today, though, and I really enjoyed it. So I think I'm going to maybe do a vegan reaction to Game Changers. Maybe I'll watch it, like, live again, and then post my reaction. I think there was really only one part of it that I may have not agreed with completely, but... Um, it was a really good movie, so I would suggest everybody watch it. But anyway, that's all I've got for today, what I ate, and kind of what we did a little bit. Um, and that is it. Bye!